Hey, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Grimrock 2, or should I say Let's Mop Up Legend of Grimrock 2. We've finished the game in the last episode, or you know, I, I think we did finish it in the last episode, but we've got another power gem. We have one more thing left to do, and the game is clearly telling us that we can go and do that thing. So we've seen in the last episode, you've seen that ending. I don't, don't know whether this is a stalkery, you know, multiple ending situation or what. Um... But we're going to go and hopefully I've got the third or well, the fourth power gem for the um, the Shrine of Balance already there. Otherwise, we have some backtracking to do. And oh, we got a healing crystal, which we're so totally using. If I don't, by some miracle, already have that last um, power gem there, I will off-screen my search for the others because I have overlooked one somewhere at that point and I'm not going to make you sit through what could be me replaying the entire game. So that was where the Cursed Compass was which I don't think we really need to worry about again, I don't see us having to come back here. That said, do I even have it around? Right, so you can go back there because I don't see us ever needing you again. And oh, hey, asshole! All right, that's right. We got one last thing to fuck up completely, haven't we? All right, so no, we haven't. Okay, well, let's take the others that we do have. One, two, three. Okay, and we need to go and find number four. So, as I said, I'm going to off screen this bit. I suppose he went off in the direction that we need to. Um, yeah, couldn't care less. Okay, well, we're going to off screen it. And I will see you when I have found the remaining power gem. Until then. Hey, and so I'm still searching for the um, last um, power gem. And I thought that, well, uh, we, I just stumbled into the hub and I noticed that, hey, we've got these other checkpoints. Killbridge Bog, we haven't checked yet. But then, 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 I made the mistake of going, hey... There's a staircase here. Have I used this staircase? And I went down the staircase. And I saw the power gem and I thought, okay, well, it's a basement. I've been here before. But then I got the little achievement pop up down there, uh, Cartographer, which is, I believe it's visit every level once, which means I hadn't been here before, but now I have, in fact, been everywhere. Um, and then I walked down here. And then I saw this sign, which basically says, Nope of the Nope. Um, so we're going to quick save. We're going to walk in here, and we're going to explore the nope out of this. And I can already see that I'm going to want my fire shield going. That's a key, well a lock I should say, we need a key for that. We don't need a key for that apparently. And that is an elemental, that's a spot for another elemental stone, so I guess we know where we put the balance stone when we have found it. I can almost hear, I can almost hear it. Whoa! Okay, duly noted. Lots of things for keys. So lots of locks, but no keys is what I mean to communicate with my apparently dwindling grasp of the English language. I can hear the healing crystal. So I guess we have to dodge fireballs through here. I don't suppose we can pick this. No. Nope. 
Okay, what about down here? Nothing there. Well, I think that we've pretty much cleared everything out that we can here for now. Okay, well, that being the case, I might just uh, stop recording here again while I go and find... Yeah, while I go and find that other power gem. Oh, what does that do? That's... Okay, so we're going to get locked in here at some point. I imagine that we're going to have to fight him in this with fireballs going everywhere. And he'll drop the key that lets us out. That's my cynical view of it. But anyway, thought I'd just update you on that. And I will see you when I've found the power gem. Until then. Okay, and we are back. And I believe I have in fact found somewhere previously unexplored. Because my map says that, well, we haven't been here yet. Oi, do you mind? I am trying to be expositive here. Fine. No, it took himself out. Anyway, as I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by that prick. Um, eat up. Okay, so we have the hub key. So, hey, I was right. The, um... Um, fortunately it was right next to where we needed to be which was also convenient because it will get us home again now I might also visit that underwater um, sanctuary uh, cache bit again just to make use of I don't like where this is going just to make use of the uh, gold keys that we still have the serpents can be awakened we don't fucking want to awaken the serpents. Why can't we awaken the fairies or, or the nymphs? I'm sure our adventurers would appreciate that after all they've been through. But no, it has to be fucking serpents, doesn't it? It's always with the serpents. Okay, so what's this? Reflexus. So, I am assuming that we need to be reflecting each other. So... Oh, so you're up, center two or down, center two or up, everyone is down, what's the point? Everyone is up. And everyone is down. I am... Unsure... Whether I get the bloody point. Do we just have to flick it and get the old one out? Hmm. That is almost everything to be explored. Whoops. Don't suppose there's a clue or a scroll or something hidden around here. There's a gate. I'm willing to bet that that's a dead end just looking at it. It looks pretty dead-endy from here, so let's not bother jumping in after it. And that brings us back here. So at least it brings us back somewhere nice and central. Oh my lord. However, 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 we are left with the nagging issue that we don't know how to solve this particular puzzle. There's no secret button hidden on the wall log here.
Hmm. Why not at this point? I honestly have no idea what we're meant to achieve here. We've just got a bunch of switches that all interact with each other. Reflects us. It tells me that... Well, I would think that they're meant to reflect each other. Either reflect each other or... That it's something about reflexes. No clues beyond that. There's just a sign saying the hub. I think I'm going to look up what I need to achieve, not how to do it, but I just want to know what I'm gonna what I have to do here because yeah, it's kinda keen. And I'm back and so apparently they all need to be facing down, not up. I'm halfway there! I give myself credit for that at least, I guess. Okay. Oh, really? I just had to do what I was... Ugh. Okay, we've done it. We've done it. Okay. We've got the power gem. We're gonna go, we're going to get to the Shrine of Balance, and I'm not going to question it, I'm not going to look this gift horse in the mouth. I am, however, going to quick save, because I do want to, before we do this next bit, I just want to go back to find that flooded mine bit, which was, I believe, in not this area. I believe it was on... Um, the island with that shrine in the middle, which was this way, I believe. Oh, crap. I'm glad I saved. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, not a stranger to them trying to inhale water at this point. Uh, yeah, there was much rage getting to the bog. I may, I may also need to render my videos before I can record the next one anyway. Because I don't want to run out of hard drive space mid-battle again. Yep, this is where I want to go, I believe. Oh, hey! A few experience points. Barely worth the time it takes to stab them, really. No, that's not the one I wanted. Whoops, I wanted to head north. Oh well. Let me stab some of those twig root things. Which I guess isn't a bad thing. You can never stab too many of them. So... Um, do you, um, just talk amongst yourselves, guys. Oh my god, we are again headed in the... Oh no, we're heading in the right direction this time. We just need to turn this way. Splash. I am so relieved that that power gem was where I hoped it would be. Because otherwise it was a matter of finding a walkthrough and then one by one, going to each of the power gem locations. And there are 25 of them, and as I'm sure you can expect, they ain't all easy to get to. So there's the pyramid, about which I truly don't care anymore. So this should be the flooded one. Yep. Oh. Now I remember noticing mention of a secret in here, which is the reason I want to check this one out specifically. 
Oi, fuck with, I can't kill you. How do you attack something underwater like that? Like seriously, what do you do there? Do I just kind of keep hoping? No, nope, we can't even telefrag them. Like if I just sleep, like for, I don't know, the day, does that move them? Come on, one more. Or not. At least with someone now that we can move around. The vault. How about we find the room with... With a ladder to get back up and get some air. Air the weed that I don't really care about. Okay. The floral vault. So that's where we would be interring Jahira. We have the golden vault with some kind of big stick. Long sword, frost bombs, which we actually do want now. Because I have a feeling I know what's coming up and that kind of frightens me. The glass vault. Now where was it? Just rest here. And quick save. And there is of course the cache to check out also. I'm positive there's like a secret button or something. Come on. Oh, I think we just managed to avoid him. Some scuba gear would be great. Ah. Of course, now we're going to die. Yep. Now is when we die. 15, 12. So it is better and it is worth grabbing. Okay, well, now that we know, I'm going to grab this bit off screen because, yeah, stuff. Stuff getting locked in there. So back in a minute. Okay, welcome back. Now, I'm probably going to end up rendering this at 7.20, but we don't really care because it's one of those prep episodes. Um, and for that reason as well, I'm probably going way over time now. I did get the crystal thing, um, and I actually managed to, to jump frag one, but only one, of the, uh, Zarktons, or whatever the hell they're called. So we've got a, more caches here, we've got a thieves cache, we've got the conjurer's cache, which was what we chose last time, we've got the paladin's cache with a healing potion and probably just a shield of the elements that I'm not too enamored with because we've already got one snake charmer's cache so i really think the only one i need to give a flying fudge about is this one with some lock picks which we'll never use a crookhorn longbow 8 to 24 plus dex 8, 9 to 28 plus dex shoots two arrows at once versus shoots shock arrows nope i'm happy with what we got but, hey, arrows, and a speed potion. So I'm going to hang on to the other keys in case anyone else suggests, hey, this is something cool to go look at, or if I've missed a secret or something, because, hey, I'm more than happy to take requests at this stage in the piece. We can save the game, and even though I'm going to be finishing it, you know, well and truly, by the time you know, this gets uploaded, um, I will still be able to load up and go back and find other cool things. So, 
we will just save our oh, rest. Ah, there we go. Okay, we'll just get everything sorted. We will feed our party while it is on our mind and while we don't really need much. Which is good because we don't seem to have much. And we're going to call it there. So a quick save and a regular save. And I will see you next episode wherein we will make the final power gem and hopefully finish the game for good. Until then, cheers.